Hey guys, it's Coach Suzanne here, and I'm talking about the whiteboard for Friday, May uh, 29th. Don't forget, today we have our outdoor classes at 7 a.m., 12 p.m., 4.30, and 5.30. You guys have been great. Just make sure you sign up on the Zen Planner, um, or you can't come to class. Uh, let's start up with the warm-up today. It's an EMOM for nine. This is for equipment and no equipment here. So you have here, we have the first minute for prisoner good mornings. The second minute, you have five tuck ups plus 20 second bent hollow hold. And your third is 20 second per side prisoner split squat hold. Um, real quick, a demonstration of that. So you guys know with the tuck ups, it's here, tucking up here. You have five of those and then bent hollow hold, keep those shoulders down, we do those a lot. Now the split squat is something we're gonna do in our strength. So make sure you have your knees bent 90 degrees, chest up and really hold. You got 20 seconds on one leg, 20 seconds the other. Uh, your street today, you have three sets and I'm gonna go through equipment and no equipment. So you have three sets here. So your first set is six to eight per leg, dumbbell, kettlebell, goblet, split squat at three zero X zero. Um, so that is where we just talked about the split squats. You're coming up here. So it's the three zero X zero. So it's three on the down, pop right back up and then go right back down. So you have per leg, again, it's into that ab squat. Then if you have uh, no equipment, you have same thing, except you're not doing a goblet hold. So you remember uh, equipment is goblet holds. You're holding kettlebell, dumbbell in a goblet position. No equipment is, uh, just a split squat and the same tempo. Then your second movement is six per uh, leg, six to eight per leg, dumbbell, kettlebell, goblet cyclist squat at three, zero, three, zero. So you guys remember this uh, cyclist squat, make sure you have your heels about a quarter inch off the floor. Um, if you can use a plate, you can use a piece of wood, you can use all kinds of different things for that. Um, and you make sure with that tempo, it's three, zero, three, zero. So it's three on the down, no hold. And remember cyclist squat, you have a, like you're riding a bicycle, so it's a shorter um, squat here. So you go down three, no pause at the bottom, up three. And that with uh, equipment, you hold with dumbbell, no equipment, no dumbbell or anything. You just hold it to your side, um, keep your chest up and engage your core. Then everybody has 10 squat jumps, equipment or no equipment, so it's 10 squat jumps. So that is the strength, which is three sets, rest as needed. Now for the Metcon, we have what we did before recently with the ladders where you go three, six, nine, 12, nine, six, three. And this is for equipment and no equipment. So I'll go over the equipment really quick. So the equipment is alternating single arm dumbbell devil press, Woo. lateral burpee over dumbbell, and then dumbbell chainsaw row each arm. So that's the equipment. So really quick with that. So single arm dumbbell press, guys. So you remember here, uh, you're doing the alternating, the double press, lateral burpee over dumbbell, have the dumbbell on the ground. So make sure you're doing a burpee and hopping over um, with two feet. And then the chainsaw roll, you guys remember, keep it down, you're praying it from the ground and rowing up, slightly rotating, uh, just like if you're using a chainsaw. Then if you have no equipment, you have burpee tuck jump. And uh, then you have seated pike ups. And then after each um, round, you're gonna be doing 20 mountain climbers. Uh, so the burpee tuck jumps here, uh, guys remember you do a nice burpee, like we know how to do burpees. And then the tuck up, once you get up from that burpees is your two feet up tuck up instead of just the jump up like we normally do you're doing a tuck up and then you have seated pike cups so we've done these where you have your hands here um, and you can't see me oh please so you have your hands here and you're piking up and back down pull those shoulders back engage your core up and down so you're doing that for the count and then once you're done with the first round, you got 20 mountain climbers and so forth until you finish. Uh, if you guys have any questions, concerns, give us, uh, email us or DM us. If not, we hope to see you in class.